In this video, I'm going to show you some uh, modifications to make this uh, better. This is an upright action rotating rack. And I'll show you how this rack works. So uh, it's got this uh, butterfly nut, and it's uh, the main problem with this butterfly nut is there's not much torque you can put on it. And what this rack's supposed to do is this action is supposed to be able to rotate so I could work on all the parts easily. And uh, that's what I do voicing on for the underside of the hammers. So this thing rotates. But the problem is this part right here turns and tightens through here and it tightens this uh, clamp onto this uh, post. And then this stops this from rotating. But like I said, this right here is really hard to turn. It's awkward. And then because this, you can't clamp it down by hand. Usually you want to put a tool on it and really clamp it down. And it's just uh, awkward. So I'm going to show you some improvements on this that make this thing uh, super nice. So the first improvement is I get a block of wood. Make it... Uh, round off all the edges and then I epoxy a nut into it and then uh, with this I'm able to grab it way better than the butterfly wing nut and so um, I'm able to clamp down much better and it doesn't budge and so if I just loosen a little bit and I can rotate this. You can see here I've got it horizontal. And it's not moving. That is that is firm. So this may not be, be an improvement, but more like maintenance. So this part right here, this will actually bend a little bit. And if this is sticking out, if this is, if these forks aren't parallel, then it will make this sit at an angle which will upset the ability to rotate the action. So if this is sitting off crooked, it's usually because this is bent. So I had to get this one, put it on the anvil, and bend it back till it was parallel, and that fixed that problem. Next little maintenance thing to fix is taking this out and spraying some grease in there. And I use this white lithium grease, and that made a huge difference. It makes it where you can clamp down easier and it rotates in there nice. So the combination of greasing this, making sure those are parallel so that this sits out straight, and the new handle, when you make those three little uh, improvements, then it really transforms this thing. Uh, this thing was a pain in the butt. Wouldn't hold tight, it'd be moving and all that stuff. Then after I made these little improvements, now it works like a dream. So, all right, so there you go, just a little, little maintenance and improvement. Thanks for watching.